that. So what about how your energy levels throughout the day? How has, has that changed much? Low carb, keto, western price, bull crap. This is the truth and this is what it looks like. Okay, everybody, it's August 2nd. This is the Vegan Carburetor. I'm back with another video about Vegetable Police. He's been on the carnivore diet now for three weeks. All beef, all the time. Actually, not all the time. We just assumed that he would eat a regular, normal carnivore diet like the way most people eat. How naive were we? We should have known. That live interview he did a couple days ago with the Primal Edger guy, turns out, yeah. He said a lot of stuff in that interview and because of my extensive knowledge for years of study on YouTube, I know evidence when I see it. I can piece things together that other people would not connect because they don't really understand the way our physiology works with food. First evidence, roll the clips. Like I haven't perfectly dialed it in, but my, on the whole, like my energy is amazing compared to what it was before. Like it's much better, much more sustainable. And I'm eating one meal a day and I find that it's no problem. There it is. Did you catch it? <laughs> one meal a day. Well, that's not really eating the carnivore diet. In fact, he is fasting. Then he fasts every day for 23 hours. Light eating, which makes you feel better, but you can't sustain that, of course. And he's probably getting a faster's high, too. I'm eating one meal a day. I'm eating one meal a day. I'm eating one meal a day. We gotta put a beat to that. I'm eating one meal a day. One meal a day. I'm eating one meal a day. One meal a day. I'm eating one meal a day. One meal a day. I'm eating one meal a day. One meal a day. And I find that it's no problem to do the 23 hour fast. Another segment of this interview that is relevant to this and why he might be feeling good. Let's roll that clip. I've wondered if I'm, if meat is just clogging me up inside. It's like, is it just like, because not as much comes out. And it's like, well, is it just accumulating in here or what? So I did like a couple of salt water flushes and animals. We'll leave it at that. Elimination's getting better. The, uh, the, 30, banana the 30 bananas a day diet, I don't think is going to be the greatest diet for, uh, for your bowel movements. And, uh... Okay, a couple of salt water flushes and then and, and enemies. Those things will make you feel good by having the same effect as a fast would. It, it just gets everything out of your system and really lightens you up. This is not the carnivore diet making him feel great. And remember, again, he has eliminated the stuff that bothers his medical conditions. It's nothing to do with veganism. All right, I gotta get moving on my next video. Now, is there anything left to put into this video? What about how your energy levels throughout the day? Has, has that changed much? It's up and down. I'm still not 100% sure my energy is amazing compared to what it was before. Like, it's up and down. I hope that clears everything up for you. <laughs> My work is done here. Thumbs up, share, and you might want to see this video here. My cartilage broke down because of a protein deficiency. Literally freely guiding me through the vegan diet. Okay, there we go. So why would I not 
blame the person who told me that I didn't eat very much protein in a day, and then come to the conclusion, based on a lieutenant colonel in the Air Force who was a doctor, saying that my muscles and my cartilage broke down because of a protein deficiency. So I switched back to the vegetarianism, okay. and it has more protein, and suddenly all of these physical ailments go away. Okay, well, the, you're misusing the word protein deficiency. You were just... Oh, uh, shit. Vegan gains veers off course again. Instead of addressing the ridiculousness coming out of Onision's mouth. Let's analyze what he said. Exactly. He said, my lieutenant colonel, who is a doctor. Okay, there's his first mistake. I hate doctors. They have butted into the diet community where I've got no business. He ends up believing Colonel Bro Science instead of Freely, and then points out that Freely is not formally educated, and I guess the Colonel is, even though I've never heard of a Colonel of <laughs> nutrition.